So Project Outreach is actually a new project that we're just undertaking, which is where we're going into outer lying communities um, around San Diego County and eventually around um, the state of California and going to places where we know that we lost Prop 8 and we know we need to start gaining more support. And we want to keep that conversation going. So that's why we're going out into these more rural areas or places where we haven't traditionally found support for gay marriage. By initiating conversations, the more people talk about these issues, the more they become um, supporters of marriage equality and the freedom to marry. So our goal is to really provoke conversations uh, through a variety of ways. We, we, we have um, you know, earned media, public demonstrations, um, speakers bureaus, really fundamentally this public education project where people start having conversations with their friends and their family about the freedom to marry. I'm actually with Marriage Equality USA and we're out here um, talking to people about the way that Prop 8 affected real couples and families. Is that something that's important to you? Oh yeah, definitely. Oh hi, uh, my name's Robert. I'm a volunteer with Marriage Equality USA. And we work as a grassroots campaign. Um, we're helping to tell the real stories of people affected by the passage of Proposition 8. Uh, my name is Ben from San Diego. and. Um, we, we're, we live in America, and where it should be the land of the free. Um, we shouldn't segregate, you know, who can do, uh, who can marry, who can't. Uh, we're all tax-paying citizens, and I believe we're entitled to equal rights for everybody. Um, I think that um, marriage equality is important to me because it affects a lot of people. Um, I know a lot of, I know people who have been in very long-term relationships that are gay relationships, and I think it's really wrong that you know that. Proposition 8 passed in the state period as someone who had just moved out to California. I was just extremely disappointed and uh, hope to lend a hand and do anything I can do to help. All right, my name is Blake. I'm from San Diego, California, and I believe gays should have the right to marry because we deserve the same civil rights as everybody else. Well, I hope that one day um, it won't matter if you're gay or lesbian, <laughs> that you'll have all the same rights and that you'll be accepted in schools, you'll be accepted in the workplace and that people can just get over the fact that, you know, people have different orientations. Support us, and then train them how to have government. It's like, hi, I'm Betty Sue, and I live, you know, in the house across the street. And I hope that being gay or homosexual or bisexual or transgendered or whatever is no longer an issue to people in the next few years. This dog famous hand. tolerating, it's accepting and embracing. So that's why it's so important that we continue to fight until we eventually reach that day where everyone, everyone is truly equal.